Hi guys, so this was actually my first time trying a bread out. If you want to see how I got to this point, just keep watching. So in order to add a little moisture to my hair, I added some of my shea butter cream to my hair, then did some flat twists, put on my satin scarf and let it sit for a little bit. When I was ready to begin the braiding, I took down each of those flat twists one at a time. I just did some slight detangling to ensure that there were no knots and then I parted each of those sections into the sections that I wanted for each braid. I detangled a little bit to ensure that there were no knots in the ends. And for this style guys, I am using my Eco Styler Gel in the olive oil and I applied a little bit of that gel to each of these sections. I smoothed it in nicely to the strands of the hair and concentrating on the ends to ensure that they were well coated. I run the comb through it a little bit to have it nicely smooth and then I began braiding. When I got to the ends, I just twisted it up a little bit and then moved on to the next section. Guys, let me tell you, I got so tired while doing this and I think I can now consider myself to be well inducted into the white residue crew. <laughs> I have absolutely no idea how the residue was so high on these guys. So when I was finally done with the braiding, I let it sit and air dry for a little bit and when I was ready for bed, I threw on my satin scarf and went to bed. So the next morning, I just took off my satin scarf and it was all dried, or at least I thought it was all dried. So in order to take down the braids guys, I took some of my castor oil put a little bit into the palm of my hands, I rubbed it in and then applied it lightly to the braids so as to avoid freezing when I started taking on the braids. I was sure to be very careful guys while taking out these braids so as to avoid freezing and to keep my definition nicely intact. It's awesome! Nice! You guys can tell that I am loving the definition, right? Yes, I am. Yup, just a quick moment to do a happy dance. And guys, some parts to the back were not fully dried, but oh well. And guys, oh my goodness, this takes time.
finally done. You know, like I mentioned, some of the parts to the back were still a bit damp, but overall I found that it, it was not bad at all. absolutely loved the definition guys but I had to strategically place some of those that were still fluffy because they were not dried properly and I have actually wanted to try a braid out for a while now and for my first try I found that it came out pretty okay But this is a style I really like guys and I will definitely give it another try until I get it to look just the way that I want it to. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye!